uh, hi and welcome I hope you are good uh, this video is about how to create uh, our data frame from scratch so basically I won't be reading uh, a CSV file or an Excel file or a text uh, file uh, into an R data frame but I'll be creating uh, an R data frame from scratch uh, it might not need it always but sometimes during data analysis or machine learning uh, you might need to create a small data frame manually so in uh, so as you can see here I'll be creating this data frame it has uh, three different columns first is element name second is atomic symbol and third is atomic number so basically I have taken four different elements from the periodic table and uh, they are hydrogen carbon oxygen and sodium now in your case the data frame might look different but I just wanted to uh, take some elements basically remembering chemistry uh, so let's start uh, with creating this data frame uh, using R so I'll be using base R I'll not be using dplyr or R table to create this uh, data frame uh, just base R so the method to create this uh, data frame is so first we need to use data dot frame and in this we need to create a uh, uh, different elements different columns with and pass on uh, different vectors to that column so the first column is element name so element name and then we need to pass in the elements of this uh, column as a vector so I'll pass hydrogen comma carbon comma oxygen comma sodium okay so let's see what this creates uh, this uh, this itself will create a data frame okay so there is an error this should be equal to okay so right now I have created a data frame which has only one column that is element name so now let's add on uh, different columns so atomic number so comma atomic number equal to C so in this we need to pass in uh, hydrogen in quotes C O uh, just remember the because this is a string so we need to pass it uh, inside uh, inside double quotes O comma N A so this will create another column now let's create the third column that is atomic oh sorry I created this by mistake this is atomic symbol and atomic number equal to C so now th these are numbers we just need to pass in the numbers without quotes 8 11 okay so this created our data frame now one more thing I'd like to add here is when we are mentioning the column name if there is no space uh, between the columns uh, suppose that column name has two words in it and there is no space in between so then in that case it is not necessary to put the quotation the double quotes so for example what I mean by that is even if I remove the double quotes here in the element name in the column name it should work just everything will remain same okay so this also created a data frame but in case suppose there is a space in between it should give an error so since there was no space in between we can use the name itself without quotes uh, but it's a good practice to put the name of the columns in in double quotes so I'll just write the summary of this what we have done so we need to so we need to to create a data frame from scratch all we need to do is data dot frame we need to pass in the column name in quotes and the corresponding vector with entries let's say a comma 
b comma c just just an example i'm taking okay so this will create a da data frame and uh, this that's it for this video and uh, i hope it was useful thank you and take care